So in the book, you have two Tracys. You have the old Tracy and the young girl Tracy. Tell me a little bit about the young girl. <laughs> My sisters are going to probably kill me for this, but um, I have four sisters. And I remember very vividly um, all of the teenage angst in our house uh, that uh, my parents were put through. Um, you can you can wear my clothes, but only after I've worn them first. Uh, you can't take my makeup. Uh, somebody's using my shampoo. Uh, who stole my diary? Uh, get out of my room. It's my room too. Uh, doors being locked. Um, as well as a lot of the love. You know, um, they fought a lot uh, about, you know, stupid things, but they were the best of friends and they were always first to come to each other's rescue. You did not cross my sisters. Uh, if you did, you incurred the wrath of the other three. Um, they truly loved each other and that's really what I wanted to capture for Tracy and her sister, uh, Sarah. I wanted to have that, that love-hate relationship. Um, Sarah is an imp. You know, she's a little kid who has got a big personality and is constantly in trouble and constantly doing things, but she's got a huge heart and um, that was very important to the story because um, when she disappears, it takes a large part of Tracy's heart and a large part of the heart of Cedar Grove.